My name is John Luttrell and I'm a Housing Program Supervisor with the City of Fresno City Attorney's Office, Code Enforcement Division, and uh, Special Teams Unit. Currently I oversee the illegal dumping team. Ultimately, uh, our goal is to eliminate illegal dumping. Right now, we spend a lot of time combating it. We've been able to work with a local business, providing very robust and technical camera equipment. The cameras are really good at catching uh, the illegal dumping incidences day or night. Um, they have infrared capability, and so we're able to obtain that license plate information. We will run that plate, obtain the registered uh, owner information, and then we will locate and, and talk to that registered owner regarding the illegal dumping incident. A lot of times, too, when we come out and we have an illegal dumping incident on camera, we'll also go through the pile and just take a quick look, see if there's any mail. Example, here's a, a FedEx invoice uh, delivery. So we'll take this and after we run our plates, see if any of the address information that was located in the pile you know, corresponds with uh, where the vehicle is registered to. A lot of items that are getting dumped are mattresses, appliances, household items. Doesn't matter if it's one tire, a truckload of tires, a small little trailer full of debris or a whole dump truck full of debris. It's $1,000 for the first citation. The second citation is $1,500 and the third citation is $3,000. Revitalization is a big part of Fresno. We need to revitalize the hearts of people. We need to help them make better decisions. We need to help them understand the laws and the regulations um, regarding illegal dumping and help instill a sense of pride for their community and their neighborhoods. And it's really nice when you're out there in the field and you start developing these relationships with the public because they see you out in their neighborhoods two to three times a week. They're excited about what is happening, that their neighborhoods are being cleaned up. And then to go back to an area that you've been working on for a year or two and you see the number of dumping incidents decrease and the neighborhood looking better, yeah, I, I take a lot of pride in that. Yeah.